keyhole or the key of the city is the keyhole in a door or that arch which opens a city in old times and which is of the shape of a hole in a wall. So we have had walls always and the need for doors in them to close and open them from inside or from outside on things or for people. The door of these paintings, for which the artist has his comedy, insightful and creative as he is, chose the keyhole as a title, is closed from the inside as it seems, since it shows through the keyhole what looks like orange warm living shapes. Our visual artist chose to work on his painting tacitly as he did not draw any random door. Indeed, what appeals to us about this beautiful work is that it invites us through this special and forbidden door to deliciously imagine what is behind it which excites the curiosity of the eye. To this type of door, or of doors, our artist gave the attribute of the doors of the hidden pleasure. That pleasure, or joy, which is quite evident in this piece of work despite its little title, the keyhole, which invites us and entices us to ride our imagination beyond it towards what he exhibits directly there in that closed side of the painting. People in general have a tendency to prevent each other by means of locks and keys from discovering what is hidden behind doors but it was inevitable through time that there appear now and then singular and distinguished people among them who enjoy deeply and with openness the curiosity of innocent children who insist on seeing the world with translucent eyes like our curious artist as his comedy actually who set out his vision on the canvas in colors and with his daring brush thus taking advantage of the delicate relationship which exists between the brush and the people, so to uncover the hidden issue in life to the world in plasticity, or to rather put a colored end to the public prohibition with light and soft brush caresses on the skin of the canvas, reflecting thus his delicacy by putting on white from his imagination his forbidden designs, exposing thus the natural secrets of people by means of unusual, modest colors, as if he pulls the doors off the walls to open a wide view through the tiny hole of the key on beauty. The painting in the keyhole is in fact every canvas which stands naked facing the painter in a canvas which closes itself in its whiteness so that our visual artist, as his comedy, could take his painting material to open in it with his brush and with gentle and voyeuristic movements of his hand, the doors of his visions, to open them wide to the world as if the hole of the key is a hole on a normal and bare sheet of paper which would be the beginning of a defloration within the framework of a project of beautiful creative prospect. The painter and poet Aziz Bumhidi is a profound artist who handles the thickness of colors with a light hand that never tires of deliciously and continuously caressing special areas on the canvas to arouse the details in it towards an intensive stimulation of the curious eye so to make it perceive the main detail in its core.
which is the keyhole. After this challenge of the eye to the door and this progression towards the entry of the key, we can, through the bowl, clearly see the concentration of the orange and light brown colors in the center of the framework, with the distribution of the lines down and the absence of shadows, reflecting what seems to be the gestures of two women changing clothes, and here again, we can conclude that the woman is the major theme in the paintings of this living dead or dead living artist in his special fully live colors who constantly renews himself by means of the journeys of his light and fine lines which drifts on the woman's body land. This is a way where the artist buries himself or something of him in his paintings by means of which he expresses how he penetrates reality with his own vision so as to reappear each time that someone else looks at them, someone else like you, dear visitor.